before we had two meetings, and first I want to thank uh, the members of the Luzerne County delegation standing with me today, uh, Representative Mulry, Senator Baker, uh, Representative Tuho, and our county manager that was with us today, Dave Pedry, uh, along with Representative Pashinsky, Representative Bobak, and Representative Carroll, all standing together united, uh, not only uh, to fight for SEI retreat, but SEI Waymart and SEI Fractal, the three prisons on the list from northeastern Pennsylvania. We met with Superintendent Mooney uh, and his senior staff. Uh, we learned some very important uh, information. 50% of the inmates at SEI Retreat are considered and classified as mental health inmates. That's very important. Uh, that's a unique inmate and that requires unique security uh, that's being supplied now at SEI Retreat that may not be able to be accommodated at another facility. So that's a strong argument to keep SEI Retreat open. We met with the staff, the workers. We there are high emotions. Uh, there's a lot of uncertainty and uh, you interject those two factors into a correction system, uh, that's a, re a recipe for disaster. We shouldn't be creating uncertainty. We shouldn't be creating high emotions among the staff or the inmates. Uh, this is all over the media now so the inmates know uh, that there is uncertainty uh, whether or not they're going to be shipped out of a, uh, one of these facilities or whether a corrections officer or staff are going to be shipped 100 miles away uh, from their home here in Luzerne County. So all of those concerns were conveyed. We had a very productive of conversation about some of the other numbers. I mean, that's part of the process here. When you're talking about being under the gun in 10 days to make a decision uh, about the budget of Pennsylvania without doing your due diligence, not having all the numbers, we heard some numbers today that, that counter some of the numbers from the department. We want to get it right. We're all united in getting it right. We recognize we have serious budget uh, consequences, uh, but we also recognize that a thousand jobs lost in northeastern Pennsylvania, an impact of $100 million, would devastate the economy of Luzerne County. We're going to make an argument. The economic impact is tremendous. Uh, Newport Township, uh, double digit unemployment, 6.3% unemployment in the county as a whole. 315 uh, staff members there at SCI Retreat live here in Luzerne County, live in these neighboring communities. It would be a $700,000 blow to our schools. Uh, it'll be a it'll be four hundred thousand dollar blow to Newport Township. That's a third of its operational blow. It's not going to be able to survive that kind of impact. And in addition to the county, a quarter of a million dollars to the county. So the economic impact at SCRG is enormous. They are operating at great efficiency. They're operating at operational capacity in terms of the number of inmates. We can make an argument, particularly with the mental health side facility, and I think we can make the same argument for SCI Waymart and SCI Fractal. They are operating at efficiencies, and they have an enormous economic impact on northeastern Pennsylvania.